Hello everyone. This is a tutorial on why Aura Contact Center 6.4 HA configuration, high availability configuration. In this video, I'll show you how to how to configure the HA or how it should look like the HA configuration on ACC. Basically, we have uh, CS1K integrated with the ACC, so it's working on the MLS link. So basically, as you can see, I have 176 and 170 server. I have two different servers. So my 176 is acting as a active server, and the other server is configured as a standby. As you can see here, my active server services are are running all services are running and at the same time my standby services are standby mode but stopped services so in this video i'll show you how to do a manual switch over and how does it look like when it's switching the server from active to standby uh, what i'm gonna do is a switch manual switch but if you can you want to know the, the the automatic switch over you see this switch over is configured as 15 seconds so, so that's been if your active server goes down by any mean like for the system failure or or network failure this standby server will start picking up the services and it will convert into active server in the video description i will leave them the, the the requirement prior configuring the ha like what needs to be done what are the steps needs to be considered before configuring the ha in via aura contact center 6.4 so i'll quickly do a manual switch over and you will see how does it switch over and the messages you should you should look at while it is doing the switch over so all I need to do is I'll go to system control I'll pick the switch over you see shadow client connected and switch over is allowed because my both of the systems are synced the both of the system are up to date and you can see the details in the description how you can sync or how you can make both system up to date once you are ready click on start the message will come up it says continue to switch over select yes no. Just keep an eye on this active server. You see, the services are going down. And once the services, all services are down, and you need to keep checking the messages here. Please wait. The server is currently in progress, so you need to wait. Have a patience. Now it's requesting the standby mode server to become active. So now we quickly go to the active server. Is it like a <laughs> now you can see our standby server is is quickly coming into an action and it's picking the services up on the standby server which apparently will will be converted into active server it will take a little time to bring the services up the most important services are MLSM services TFE services and ASM services has to come up that's mean your link is established with your your PBX system and rest all 
still coming up and the most important services are up which is up CCMS the CCMS services are up and your CCT services are up and you can see this message here the switch over completed active mode survey is now running as a standby system and here you can see the same message over here disappeared now if I open the HA this was the standby server if I click here you see the standby server has been converted to is converted into active server and all the control has been moved to the active server and this is contains the main system now and this one should come into the anti shutting mode that's mean that's mean this server now started shutting the active server so guys this is how you do the HA switch over or you have seen the HA configuration I hope you like the video. Thank you very much.